work with this. Uh, it's got an off, and then this is where you set it when you want the um, timer to start working. So let's set the clock first. So let's say it is 1.05 p.m. Next, you can set what time you want this thing to start. So let's say, let's go to like 1.15. Okay, 115. Now, how long do you want this to run for? Let's say two minutes. How often? Um, several settings are available here. You can do um, one day, two day, three, four, five, and six, seven, um, every six hours, 12 hours. I'm gonna do every day. So let's say um, every day at the same time it'll cut on. Okay, this is where you keep it if you don't want it to do anything. And then here is where you'll set it if you want it to go off. So let's test it going off. I'm going to use a garden hose here. To make this happen a little faster, I'm going to set the start time a little bit less here. That sounds good, 109. Pretty dramatic, wasn't it? I think there was air in my hose. So that'll run for two minutes, and you can see on the display that it indicates both the time that it is and the amount of time left that will be um, running the water. So right now it says 109, two. So at 110, it'll show one uh, and etc. like that. So by turning this to the off position, you can stop the timer early. Now if you would like to use the hose while this is attached, you can um, set to auto, push the manual button, and then tell it how long you want to use manual. So for instance, one minute here. And it'll come on manually for that amount of time. Now once again, you can turn it to off and allow that to stop.